Randall Woodfin says he wants to make the city of Birmingham safer for everyone. And he's asking a task force to consider many public safety reforms. Tonight, as WVTM 13's Jeff Eliasoff tells us, it was the public's turn to speak out. At City Hall Wednesday night, Mayor Randall Woodfin asked for citizens to help with the enormous task of building a better, more sensitive police force in times of great sensitivity. We want to hear your thoughts. We want to hear your opinions. We want to hear your solutions. We want to hear your frustrations. And so they did. A healthy dose of suggestions from folks like Natasha Stallworth, who, inspired by Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., called for better training of police officers. The root of the issue is racism, and I think it needs to be addressed, addressed in, a, uh, in a way that it would uproot negative mindsets and replace the negative mindset with a more positive outlook. And then I think from there, uh, the healing will begin. Jermaine Stanton wants a seven-person police review board with five citizens and two police supervisors. To serve as a mechanism to quickly identify and disconnect a potentially dangerous police officer from the community before a citizen is seriously injured. A secondary function of the police review board is to serve as an olive branch of transparency and accountability. In times of tension, says Task Force Co-Chair Hunter Williams. I think it's prudent to always be taking a look at how we can do better. Over the next few weeks, this public safety task force will compile many of the suggestions in their recommendations to Mayor Woodfin. And we'll be following those findings. Jeff Elias off WVTM 13.